Hi, I'm Mickey Knowles with the National Watermelon Promotion Board, and I'm here to show you how to carve a watermelon into a hedgehog. First, you want to start with a medium to large seedless watermelon. You want to wash it and pat it dry before you start. Next, place the watermelon on its side and cut one quarter of an inch off the yellow belly so that the bottom sits flat. Be careful not to cut too deep into the white part of the rind. Place the watermelon so that its stem will be the nose. Find a point at the top of the watermelon about a quarter of the way down the length of the melon. At this point, draw vertical lines with the green dry erase marker halfway down both sides of the watermelon. Then, from both points on the sides, draw horizontal lines straight to the back of the watermelon. If you're happy with your proportions, use your knife and cut the lines. Remove the whole portion and place it on its side. Using a large spoon, scoop out the fruit from the removed section and from the base. Chop this fruit into small cubes and set aside. Using a small paring knife, make many small zigzag cuts around the edges of the head. From the removed section of the rind, make a triangle nose and four triangle feet. To attach the nose, place a toothpick on each side of the stem spot and attach the nose triangle. Put a toothpick in the tip of the nose and place a blueberry on the end. Make two cuts at the front of each foot triangle to create a paw. Attach his paws with toothpicks at the bottom edges of the hedgehog. To make the ears, carefully cut with a paring knife two curved triangles that come to a point into the edges of the face where desired. Gently pull the rind forward, being careful not to break it or crack it so that the ears slightly protrude. For the eyes, simply place two toothpicks slightly above the nose and put a blueberry on each end. Finally, fill your hollowed hedgehog with watermelon cubes. Place the toothpicks in the cubes on top to create the hedgehog's coat. And there you have a watermelon hedgehog.